our workout or this morning not so much stay inside yep foggy and misty conditions oh, it's actually the terrible big workout condition terrible <laughs> yes but temperatures are mild so it kind of depends on what you prefer uh, i mean well, i really true. enjoy the mild temperatures especially for this time of year right now we're situated in the 40s but as we take a look outside you'll notice a lot of us are dealing with some of that drizzly activity and mainly it's pushing off towards our east across our northeastern suburbs still seeing some of that drizzly action right now. But as we take a look at visibility, not looking good out there. Less than a mile down by Columbia, about one mile being seen up towards the Inner Harbor, less than a mile up towards Elkton and definitely seeing a good amount of fog closer to Essex, even out towards Frederick and down by Annapolis. So this morning you want to take it easy on the roadways, keep a safe distance between you in the car in front of you and also make sure to use your low beams. As we head around 9 to 10 o'clock this morning, we are going to be dealing with our visibility actually improving as that fog begins to lift. This morning, we're waking up with numbers in the mid to upper 40s, so well above normal from where we should be for late December. So yes, we're waking up to some fog, even some drizzly action out there this morning around breakfast time. It's National Bacon Day, so eat the breakfast, eat the bacon indoors. As we head into the afternoon, we're going to be dealing with cloudy conditions. It's going to be feeling mild with daytime highs in the low to mid 50s upper 40s north and west of I-95 and staying rather cloudy and mild as we head around dinner time as well. As we head around 2 to 3 o'clock in the afternoon, we'll say goodbye to that shower reaction, even that drizzly activity and the fog, but we're still going to keep that pesky cloud cover around. As we head into your Friday, we'll start to see a little bit more in the way of sunshine for New Year's Eve with the temperature right around 60 degrees. That's well above normal for this time of year, but just wait as we head into your New Year's Day. Yes, we're going to be dealing with some soggy conditions and breezy winds. Our winds will start to ramp up through the afternoon, but look at that temperature, 65 degrees. We could be challenging our record high of of 67 degrees that was set back in 2005 and yes we're forecasted to hit high of 65 degrees the normal temperature is 44 that's a 21 degree temperature difference so yes we're going to be well above normal for this time of year as we ring in the new year as we ring in 2022 staying breezy as we head into your sunday and even into early next week we'll see more in the way of sunshine as we head into your monday and tuesday mostly sunny skies with more seasonal numbers with highs in the low to mid 40s and topping out in the lower 50s heading into your wednesday afternoon all right thank you